Hello all, today in this video I am going to show a python demo for CNN from scratch that is convolution neural network from scratch with the data set is CSV data set and the data set which we are using is hard basis classification it is a binary classification model so as we do previously we have to just import the libraries which we made it uh, the libraries which we are used include the pandas, matplotlib C bond, num, e, iteration tools, then tensor flow. Then from SK loan, we have import, imported classification report, confusion matrix, accuracy score, standard scalar, train test split, and a one hot encoder. Uh, encoder. Then from the tensor flow, we have imported early stopping. Then from the keras, we have imported the layers and the models. Uh, so, and also, I uh, we have imported it separately then imported warnings also so then we are just calling our data set since we are using hard disk data, data set we have used we have uh, downloaded the hard disk data set as csv file from Kaggle and using over here and then we are seeing the details of the data set by using some functions like df info then describe the from the ds info we can see what are the columns how many columns the data set is having its size and all and what is its type whether it is an integer or float or string etc uh, then uh, we have just uh, calling the labels then we are plotting them using the count plot then sns plot uh, since it's a binary classification we are having zero and one label uh, then uh, we are using a cross tab to import call this variables then also we are using a heat map to just to see this uh, what are the all the variables in the data set then we are just declaring their train and also the test uh, variable for uh, we are using the target uh, variable and uh, then uh, here we are using 80 20 split so our test size is 0.2 if you want some other split means you have to change the test size and then we are just uh, normalizing our data set and then we are just calling the shape of the data set uh, of the normal x train and the y train then we are reshaping it since because in convolution neural network we need some three dimensional data so uh, we are reshaping our data set and uh, here also we are at both all the data that is x train then x test then y train etc so then which we are calling that data sets over here and here we are doing this from scratch since uh, we are calling the uh, using convolution layer data uh, neural network we have called the layers like convolution 1d then uh, it's max polling flatten followed by drains and dropout dropout will not be a normal neural network but if you want to increase our accuracy and in order to solve this overfitting and underfitting issues i am just using this dropout so this is the layer summary of our model then we are just compiling it using the binary cause entropy loss then we are just training it for training early stopping is not defined so we have to define so we have just uh, please we can delete that line in the previous code uh, in a and then we would have called this uh, uh, early stopping so since we haven't called here it is just showing some error for a better model the law should uh, decrease for every approach and uh, the accuracy should increase that is validation loss and validation accuracy so we can see the uh, as um, the loss is validation loss is decreasing and also the validation accuracy is increasing for every approach showing that our model is a better model now we can just plot these variables in a graph by using the plot uh, libraries 
So this is the graph we have updated. You can see the law accuracy is increasing and loss is decreasing. Then we can just know that uh, our we are just uh, uh, finding some other para performance parameters, functions such as precision, recall, and F1 score. Finally, we are just plotting and confusion matrix of our model. Uh, so. Here we are using it as y fred underscore c, but uh, here we have called it as y fred, so only it is coming as uh, y fred is not uh, declared. So we have to use the same name as previously we have called. Now you can see the confusion matrix is obtained. So it's a uh, 0.93 and uh, 0.98, so it is an uh, our uh, convolution near neural network which we have called from scratch is a better thing only so this is a convolution neural network binary classification model from scratch in the next video we can see with some other course thank you